Hey guys, Joe Frith from Caldwell Banker Prime Properties, the Frith team. Here is my first episode of You Can't Make This Stuff Up in Real Estate. So back in July 2021, one of my listings goes under contract. No one knew but the property owner behind my client's property owned a significant portion of my client's yard. The neighbor even supplied a recent survey that shows the property line goes through a third of my client's garage. So at this point, the attorney says, I'm sorry, if the neighbor owns a portion of your garage, you can't sell what isn't 100% yours. Plus, the neighbor wasn't being very cooperative with allowing for an easement. So I, the attorney and the seller, we did everything possible to get the neighbor to cooperate with us for an easement. And again and again, the neighbor declined. So this is where it takes a weird twist. The attorney jokingly says, if there was no garage, then there was no problem. So let's fast forward 24 hours. My client decides enough is enough and goes to Lowe's to buy a Sawzall and a dozen blades. And I think you know where I'm going with this. He basically cuts up the garage in a manageable four foot pieces and makes a pile at the end of his driveway. The next day comes the dumpster and Shazam, within 24 hours that garage is no more. He called me and asked me to call the attorney and tell him that the problem with the garage has been resolved. No garage, no problem. Well, it doesn't end there. The buyer was concerned that they purchased a home with a garage and now the home has no garage. Luckily, the buyers loved the home and the neighborhood enough to move forward with the transaction, but with a considerable credit at closing, of course. So at the end of the day, everyone was happy. And this is one example of you can't make this stuff up. Stay tuned for more and let our family help your family find the way home.